six. They've headlined at Glastonbury and they've had five successful studio albums. The Arctic Monkeys' journey from Sheffield to global stardom has been apparently unstoppable. Their latest offering is out today. Time for the ultimate accolade of an interview with Stephen Smith, a man who's never been accused of looking good on the dance floor. Did he just say Newsnight? The Newsnight. He did. Deal with that, Grimmy. Get your own exclusive, Ken Bruce. This is a customised version of one of the new tracks debuted by the Arctic Monkeys at the Roundhouse in London earlier this evening. Their fifth album is released today. Shall we make a start? How do you feel about that? Yeah, well, we have. But commit to celluloid. The Arctic's main creative force, Alex Turner, told us about their slightly new direction. So what were we saying? Hip-hop was has always been an influence, yeah, on, um, on the lyrics, but I think it's perhaps a bit more... On, we, you know, we've worn that influence on our sleeve a little bit more on this record. So uh, I suppose it's only subtly borrowing some elements from that world, the way the drums sound. Or... The mirror's image It tells me it's home time But I'm not finished Cos you're not by my side There's no rapping on there, Stephen. Not yet. Well, what about live? Maybe you would want to spit your truth or bust some verses or whatever the phrase is yeah what is the phrase I'm not quite sure um, I spit nothing but the truth it's good to know we're the same yeah it felt like uh, we are about to step out onto the lunar surface or something <laughs> Yes, quite a big booking. The opening ceremony of the London Olympics. The six minutes we were on stage came after like a two-month build-up or something, like so many rehearsals, and we spent quite a lot of time in that stadium that week just kind of fretting, I suppose. I think it was a, definitely a big moment for us that suddenly it was we were something else then. Like it wasn't the way our fans even or people perhaps perceived us. Maybe that changed. I don't know. I try not to get like caught up in that too much. The Arctic Monkeys got their break by sharing their songs over the internet. But Alex Turner secretly yearns for a hoarier version of the rock and roll M.O. Are you sorry that the old model's broken a bit, that it's difficult to get platinum albums and, you know, like the you, Eagles or whoever? Yeah, sometimes you wish it was just Cliff. the 70s where you could, like, have a, you know, plane and a beer belly and it was like, all right, <laughs> But um, but now you've got to like go to the gym and stuff. So that makes Turner an enemy of the buff and bland X Factor. Then, not necessarily. People get too hung up on kind of or or get too angry about the whole like X Factor and those like talent shows because you almost like. Just let them get on with it. You, you, you need that to kick against, I think. Like, if you're gonna, you know, it's um, yeah. People talk about how that's like ruined everything, but it's like there's always been sort of shitty pop music, mm. whether it came from a television show or not. Like, you know. let's see it. <laughs> The conquerors of Glastonbury now reside in Los Angeles, 
Though Alex Turner maintains Sheffield will always be home. Is it true you still take your laundry home to your mum? I did do some laundry at, at home last week. Went That's up there good. for a couple of days and, and I did did get that treatment. That you, you know. And what about you? Always do you... that extra mile. The mum's there. It's oh. like, do you want me to do this by hand? Put some comfort in. I can. Other yeah. softeners are available. Yeah, yeah. You know, soak it. This is looking a bit too off-white. Should yeah. we do something about that? We should interview his mum next week. Well, now, before we go, news then.